The show of support for Ukraine continues to grow around the world. In Paris, thousands of people took part in a rally demanding an end to the fighting, and several events were held today here in the city. As CBS 2's Leah Mishkin reports, supporters are pushing for peace. A sea of people rallied together in Times Square with a clear message. Put a no-fly zone over Ukraine. We all understand that Russia has superiority in air. We are doing our best. We are fighting. Putin has said that any country who imposes a no-fly zone over Ukraine, he'll consider them participants in this conflict. This crowd is saying stop. Putin stopped the war and they're chanting for no fly zone. There was one Ukrainian woman we spoke with who had tears in her eyes as she was calling on world leaders to take action. Please, please close their sky for Ukraine. There's lots of people. Kiss. Ludviga says her 30 year old grandson and his family are in Ukraine. He said he was going to stay to defend their country. That's what I came today to help support my beloved people. We need peace and we don't want to fight with nobody. I hope, I hope America's going to help us. The 69 year old has been in the United States for more than two decades. She says her heart is in Ukraine. It's very painful what Putin doing to our country. Another crowd showed their support for Ukraine in Lower Manhattan. They ran a 5K this morning. Chris Cohen is here to support his Ukrainian friends who have family back home. They're living in bomb shelters in the subways. Some of them have lost contact. They're not able to talk to them on the phone. One of the members of Ukrainian Running Club New York, the group that organized this event, told us his family is there too. They're fighting for our freedom, for kids, for mothers, for sisters, and we will win. In Times Square, Leia Mishkin, CBS 2 News.